What's up guys, my name is Michael and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we're going to do another elite code challenge called sort characters by frequency. Basically given a, a string, sort it, decreasing order based on the frequency of the characters. So this is actually really easy. Um, because it's decreasing order. Okay, so first you got to get the frequency of each character. After that, we're going to basically add each frequency and the character into a heap. And the heap is going to be a max heap because it's decreasing order, right? The maximum is first and it's decreasing order. After we finish adding all the values to the max heap, we're just going to iterate through a max heap and then add each character that many times to the corresponding uh, frequency it was, okay, to, a, to our string. So we're going to do that right now. This is actually pretty quick, easy, quick and dirty. Um, I'm going to call use a map to get the frequency of each character and this is going to be called freak okay i'm going to go through every ca uh, character ch inside our string um yeah we're going to do frequency at ch plus plus so for every character in our string frequency plus plus so that's going to give us a frequency of each character in our string then um, after that, I need to create a max heap to represent uh, I'm going to pair each uh, frequency with its corresponding character in our max heap. So in our max heap, we're going to continue to pairs of frequency and the character. So now vector pair int char uh yeah and because it's a max heap we don't have to pass in our comparator or anything it's a max heap because priority queues are already max heaps okay now we're gonna go through now we're gonna go through every value in our frequency list of the character and the integer for each character and each integer so i'm gonna see every value each val in our frequency list uh, I think you should make this an ampersand just in case I think uh, I just I just see people do that so yeah um, so each value uh, we're gonna do max heap dot push each value um, yeah each value then we're gonna do the first value is gonna be the occurrences and then the second one's gonna be the, each character right so we actually want to push. Uh, so in our frequency, we have we mapped each character to its occurrences, right? The free how frequent the character was inside our string. Um, so we're actually going to have to pair up the opposite way. Second, first, the reason why we're doing this is because each our each value uh, our pair our max heap compares based on the frequency of each character there the free actual frequency not the character so we have to do each character first a way you could avoid the swapping the um, way you could avoid like flipping these two is uh, actually to pass in your own comparator so then given the pair uh, you could do like instead of doing int char you could do char int and then pass in a comparator and then you compare the specific int value but I'm not doing that I'd rather just do this okay so then we're gonna push each value to our heap and then now now that's basically it now I'm gonna do while max heap size uh, actually I should do is not empty I feel like that's much cleaner instead of checking if the size is greater than zero but yeah well, it's not empty and we're going to get the top value. Uh, so the top value is a pair of, so the first value is going to be the frequent, how frequent the character is. So how frequent character is, is the first value in our pair, right? This is how frequent the character in our max heap. First one is how frequent the character is. Second one is the actual character. So here I'm going to do character uh, maxi dot top dot second 
Okay, so now we have the power frequent the character and character. Now because our max heap is sort of decreasing order based on the frequency of the characters, we just have to go through our max heap and then for every uh, for every value in our max heap, we're just gonna have to add it to our new string that we're returning. So string to return, I'm gonna make it empty. So now I'm going to basically just loop through for every i equals zero i is less than how frequent character i plus plus and i'm just going to add to return plus equal to character uh yeah after that i got to remove the first value of our max heap every time okay so that would get rid of that would get rid of uh that make sure that uh, we're moving the first value of our max heap every time, so then it'll become empty in the end. So yeah, that's how you do it, and now we're going to return to return. Submit. And it got accepted. So yeah, that's how you would do this. Uh, rate, com, subscribe. It wasn't that much difficult. Uh, so yeah, that was, that was it. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoy this video. Rate, comment, subscribe. I'll check you guys later. Peace.